In mid-June this year, a wife battery allegation was slammed against music producer calm performing artist Solomon Oyeni, popularly known as K Solo. His wife, Kike Lomo, had alleged that he not only beats her silly, he also steals from her. And now fast forward to the present. The Oyenis, or the K-Solos as they prefer to be called, sit with our entertainment team snuggling and nudging playfully to portray the perfect couple. This just doesn't add up. Nothing actually happened, you know. We're just having fun. And nothing really, nothing. I'm a showbiz person. You understand? Like, if I don't do singing, I can do acting. <laughs> so, if you actually saw, all you saw was actually acting, nobody knew. But a lot of people were thinking for another man that man's edit. But the longer I was getting bigger and I was enjoying it, because you know, this is I've never received calls from her, uh, even calls from big faces. And you know, and you know, there's some people that actually, we actually had friends before that you know, call like, hey, God, I'm catch you now. You see? <laughs> The old people where they show, <laughs> you know, but you know, I'm so happy this is gonna be because they are saying this. A prank on the media and fans to what purpose is this intended? It made me a high know my friends, it made me a high know my enemies. You understand? A lot of people were actually happy to be friends. When they had that, when they had that to do with it, the lot of people actually became my enemy. So he actually showed that he uh, actually be my enemy, playing to be friends. And the ones that actually told friends actually stood. Ah, so why did it happen? Is it true? We can never, we never had such with one, you know, like that. So on our own part too, she was able to know our friends, good friends and, and bad friends, and anyway. you know. But like you said, I'm having my phone and like you say, like you actually actually discovered during the you know, story, 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 I still had my event. So, I believe for sensible people should know that if it was actually something like that, I was real. Such event was supposed to be on the pause. And the funny thing about it is, you know, this, the, the people that actually published the story that made the old noise was Sidney Pope. And the event I had <laughs> was, was actually was um, sponsored and actually pushed by the same city people. After I even I released new singles, you know, and things were still actually still going on. So you should all understand that like, it was just acting fun. You understand what I'm saying? But you know, it made me highly know some things that we didn't know before. And you know, but yet, watch out for it. There's going to be a movie to that stuff. So it's titled Global Tone. So watch out for it soon. And so we are getting a movie spin off from this prank. More on this, please. I'm not actually doing it for Idu Mota because I know that's the end product of major movies in Nigeria. I'm not doing it for Idu Mota, for Yuba. I'm doing it for the cinema. Fine. And there will be a lot of more of comedy in it because why you're feeling all this swag, you see so many comedies in it. There's going to be, um, what is his name? Oh, the there's who? Sawyeri. There's um, from Kakinele. In the, stand, in the movie, so it's actually a movie to watch out for. This must be applauded as a prank well played. However, another interesting bit in this story is this apology coming from Mrs. K. Solo to her in laws. Um, thank you to everybody, and also to apologize to those we actually got you know, got to, like my mother in law, she's so upset because, you know, I she broke into expecting. her house. She wasn't expecting I broke into her house with the police and all that part of the whole thing, you know, and also my sister in laws and everybody. I just want to tell them I'm sorry about that and I'm sorry for going to the press. You well, sorry for fans, too. Sorry for all our fans, the Olori Kesolo fans, the Oba Kesolo fans, and the Prince Kesolo Jr. coming soon. Fans, we say sorry to you and we love you. Well, make of it what you will, but it is good to see the K-Solos appear as one jolly, happy family, isn't it? So this is our K-Solo, Solo, and you have him, Prince.